Welcome again to the Salt Lake City International Airport. Holy crap, my windshield is so dirty. Guys, I'm actually here for once, picking somebody up and not getting dropped off and flying away somewhere. So I'll give you guys a minute and you can guess who I'm picking up. I bet none of you will guess correctly, but I'm picking up a couple friends that are gonna be here in town. We're gonna do some shed hunting. We're gonna run up to the Mountain Ops office today. And yeah, so let's see if we can find them. This is always fun. Red flag, red flag, the only guy with the vlog camera. <laughs> There's Joel and Ellie. Hey, no cameras here. Put your camera down. All right, so Joel and Ellie are here. Hello. Hi. Good to see you. Good to see you. What's up, dude, buddy? How you doing? Good. Good Welcome to, to Salt Lake. Dude. We're going to go on a shed hunt this weekend, and these guys are going to join me. Over Did you? I'm like, that looks like some good ground. All the deer shed, all the big deer sheds are there. Is this what you found? Yeah. yeah, that's my that's my find for the day. Two day trip. Got killed. Their plane landed a half hour early. We were booking, <laughs> but it worked out. I'm ready to go. We're gonna go up to Mountain Ops, guys. And yeah, by the way, if you don't know these two, this is Joel with Whitetail Fit. Ellie, is that for short? No. No, it's just Ellie. Ellie. Yeah. It's not, yeah. Okay, I was yeah. ever sure if it was like Ellie. <laughs> just, just Ellie. So yeah, well, the, we're uh, gonna do a two day, well, two two and a half day shed hunt. We're gonna go camping, um, but for now we're just gonna run down to Mountain Ops and just BS with those guys and see what's new. We gotta pick up some sups too. These guys need all the sups. That's right. You all watched the vlog a few weeks ago. You saw our buddy Nick Bourne come and pick up some antlers from myself and Eric, and he's gonna he was gonna mount up. Uh, our white-tailed deer for us and our dads that we did down in Texas and I got a surprise to show you. Nick gave me the call and my dad's deer is ready. So I just picked it up today and I'm gonna surprise him with it tomorrow. Nick did an awesome job. This is kind of a cool little scar on his, on his head there but his cape is just so pretty. So, so pretty. So Nick Bourne Taxidermy is our buddy. Done a bunch of work for us. He will have Mine done, I want to say this weekend, and then he's gonna work on Eric's and Eric's dad's, and then he'll knock out Casey's and Casey's dad's. But cool, uh, cool memory for my dad to have on the wall from uh, the, the hunt down in Texas. So, you guys never watched that video series, it's a cool semi live series we did. Uh, go check it out on our channel. But hunting with pops in Texas is what it was called, and did a little fun adventure down to the BSR ranch. I'm uh, excited to share this with him, surprise him tomorrow when I go pick up my dog. We will keep you posted and show you the other deer when Nick gets finished up with them and we all have them back in our possessions. Looks like they're making some progress here at the Mountain Ops office. The landscaping's getting done. It's looking really good. We're gonna go inside and mess around with these guys and see what's new. Let you know uh, how the 90 day challenge is going and give you kind of one final chance for the end of April. Excellent. These guys, this is their first time here. I'm sure when we officially announce the flavor, so. Can't. We on. can't tell the flavors. All I can tell you guys is we are behind the scenes here at Mountain Ops. Dave, director of photography. Is that your position? What's your position title? I guess so. I think so, yeah. Okay, this guy does a lot of the uh, photography in the office and out, out in the field. But, yeah, I don't know what he's got going on, but it looks like there's a lot of berries. I can't really disclose what's going on or what flavors might be here. Wait a second. Cool Whip? Oh, I can't say anything. I didn't say anything. I can't believe is it is April 26, which means we're 26 days into this 90 day challenge. I've been killing it, I'm not gonna lie. Besides missing a workout here and there because I'm out shed hunting and whatnot, I've been following my plan to a T. I've been following the workout plan to a T, which is all on the website. We're here to just kind of wrap up and close uh, month one. And Matt and I are gonna go over stage two of my fitness program and also talk about the incentives that you have by using the hush code for the rest of this month. So once I find some, uh, once I find some snacks, we'll go into Matt's office and we'll talk about that. I will show you all you can know. That's it. And then we'll, Launching soon. Launching soon. You can oh. see the color right it there. It has a red color. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. It's towards the end of the month. It's towards the end of stage one of the workout program that I put together with Mountain Ops. So 
keep this in mind for anybody who is starting the program maybe late or recently I want you to follow st stage one for four weeks before you start stage two for those of you who follow, uh, started April 1st stage two is gonna launch real soon it's gonna be up on the website on the same tab the conquer fitness program underneath their Chesser yep. workout Yep, it'll be in your workout. So right now, all anybody can see is stage one. Yeah, we're on the back end. But uh, we'll be in stage two, and then obviously at the end, what? Stage, stage three. three. I'm not gonna give you all the details. I want you to go to the website to check out stage two, but uh, it's gonna incorporate some drop sets and some supersets. So the workouts that you guys did for four weeks is gonna change. So I'm gonna mix it up, I'm gonna make it exciting, chalk our muscles and, and all that. But it's the 26th of April, from now till the end of the month, you can use the hush code on all your purchases at Mountain Ops. And what's the new spiff? You get free shipping? Free shipping from today, the second you're watching this vlog, until the end of the month. And remember, when you guys use that hush code, you're getting entered to win a Hoyt RX1. There's some Easton, Easton arrows. arrows. Well, you're automatically entered to win the elk hunt that you guys are giving away. And the elk hunt as well. How could I forget that? That's the coolest part. No, that's the way, but. <laughs> <laughs> So anyways, yeah, free shipping, win a bow, win an elk hunt. I don't know why you wouldn't use the code. Do you know when we're gonna announce who wins the bow? That's up to you guys to decide. Make a, make do a, maybe like do a fun video on how to announce it? Yeah, or you, I mean, it might, you might just do it in your in, your, in your weekly vlog, so. Okay guys. Probably within the first week or so. Uh, so yeah, go, ahead, go to mountainops.com, get everything restocked. Month number two is gonna be killer. I know I'm excited for the new workouts. We're already, we've already done a month of the program. I can't believe a month has gone by. Freaking flew by. Isn't it? So flew by. Fast. So fast. The Facebook group is doing good, guys. There's a lot of people on the Facebook group, on the Mount Ops Facebook, Conquer Fitness group. Yeah. A lot of people in there posting about their progress, their workouts, their meal plans, recipes. So a lot of fun on, the, on their Facebook. Go check that out. But yeah, for now, we're just gonna go over stage two, we're gonna make some final changes. And then as soon as we're done here, Joel and Ellie and I, we're gonna go um, get packed up for a shed hunt. So you'll be seeing some shed hunting videos here on the channel. I just wanted to give you guys a little update on how my 90 day mountain ops transformation is coming. I can tell you right off the bat that I feel better than I've felt in years. I have more energy than I've had in a long time. I'm super motivated and by golly, people like me. So I just wanted to show you real quick what I've been doing, uh, what I've changed in my routine and uh, what my, my plan is for the next, the next week until the next Hush Life vlog comes up. So the biggest thing I've been doing is concentrating on my diet. I've been trying to eat as clean as possible. And I can tell you for the most part, I've done a pretty phenomenal job in my opinion. I started the 90 day transformation exactly 21 days ago. I started on April 5th. I weighed 238 pounds, I believe, 21 days ago. Just wanted to show you real quick what my diet has been for those 21 days and uh, show you guys what you can do if you're trying to lose weight, because that's my end goal. We all have different goals. Me, Brian, and Eric all have a different uh, goal in mind, and I'm sure you guys that are doing it at home have different goals than us, but my goal is weight loss. I'm trying to lose 40 pounds in 90 days. So I'm not a huge meal prepper, but for the last 21 days, I've committed to making something at the first of the week that I can snack on. If I don't have time to cook, I can grab on the go. But basically it has come down to lots and lots of wild game. This is all elk and deer. I've got deer hamburgers and elk steaks, and that's enough to last me for about seven days. Then I try to cook up a ton of veggies because veggies are tough. So I've got asparagus, I've got uh, zucchini in there. I've got some onions. Pretty much what I've been doing is eating four smaller meals a day. I try to shoot for about 300 calories each meal, which is usually about six ounce piece of wild game. And then, you know, probably five to six ounces of veggies. I can tell you, I have felt like I've never eaten so much in my life, but it's all clean and it's keeping my metabolism super high, which is making me feel amazing and I'm never hungry. Now, this is the weight loss combo. If you're looking to get some stuff off Mountain Ops to help you with your 90 day transformation, this is what they call the weight loss combo. This is Mountain Ops ammo, uh, it comes with Ignite. Uh, I also take Enduro and then I take two Renew pills, two Blaze pills and two multivitamins every morning. So my morning, my breakfast consists of an ammo shake and six pills basically. And then I usually take Ignite or Enduro 
two to three times a day. And then you fill in the, the four small meals a day, and I'm, like I said, I've never felt like I've been eating more food, but I also when I eat, I don't feel tired and lazy like I usually do when I eat crappy food. I feel more energized after I eat. Anyway, just wanted to show you guys real quick what I've been doing. And let's see, I haven't been weighing myself a whole lot. I don't think uh, the scale tells you exactly how your progress is coming, but uh, just out of pure interest, I'm gonna jump on the scale like I said, 21 days ago, I weighed 238, and then I believe I weighed myself uh, last vlog or the vlog before, and I was down like 10 or 12 pounds. But I'm gonna jump on here and uh, we'll see if I'm uh, headed towards my goal of 40 pounds in 90 days. Whoa. 219. That is uh, 19 pounds down. In 21 days but like I said everyone's goal is different mine is to lose some weight because I'm packing around 40 extra pounds with me when I'm in the hills or just throughout the day and that's not good for your knees it's not good for your joints it's not good for anything so uh, I'm headed towards my goal I feel like I've got roughly 65 days left um, to lose another 21 pounds but I just wanted to show you guys and this is not to brag or anything but if you stick to a program stick to a diet supplements and I have been running on the treadmill as of the last six days I've ran every day for at least 20 minutes. So that is also help, helping out a lot. But stick to a program and whatever your end goal is, whatever you're, you're trying to accomplish, stick to something. Mine's been heavily weighed on diet, supplements, and a little bit of exercise, but I'm gonna crank up the exercise here in the next 30 days and see where it gets me. But I uh, just wanna show you guys, it does work, man. It really does work. And the most important thing is I'm feeling a ton better about myself, about my weight, I have more energy, I'm more motivated during the day. But I definitely wanna say it is not a sprint, it is a marathon. So that's why I don't love jumping on the scale because I mean, some days you don't lose any weight, but you are in the process of bettering yourself and reaching your end goal. I do wanna say if you're planning on signing up for the Mountain Ops 90 Days Transformation, the last day to do it is May 20th, I believe. But why wait until May 20th? I could have waited until now, but I look back over the last 20 days and it's been some hard work, it's been a lot of hard work. But at the same time, I'm glad I decided to sign up the day I did because now I can look back and I can have no regrets of, of what I've done in the last 21 days. So don't regret it by waiting to sign up if you're planning on it, sign up today. Okay, so Eric's told you what you gotta do when you go to Mountain Ops and you purchase any of your supplies for the 90 day challenge, all you gotta do, type that hush in at the bottom and you will be automatically entered for free shipping to the end of the month, but then a bunch of other amazing prizes. I'm gonna show you one right now that we think may be one of the most favorite. You are entered to win one of these bad boys right here. So this is the new Hoyt Redworks RX-1. This particular model is all blackout. And right there, that's what you get to win. It's that easy, that simple. There's gonna be a ton of other great prizes, rumor has it, whether it be rifle, some other pretty cool stuff as well, tons of Mountain Ops products to give away. But yeah, all you gotta do is enter in Hush and you go into the bucket and I think the grand prize is going to be uh, an elk hunt in Idaho so make sure you do that I'm gonna go get some arrows sent down range this morning I'm trying to set up a new program where every morning I wake up and I shoot my bow the weather is finally nice here in Utah spring is upon us it's gonna be like 75 degrees today I'm getting excited to try to get out and kill a turkey which opens here in Utah on Monday Casey's trying to kill a turkey right now. Go check out that semi-live series. It's probably gonna start tomorrow. <clears throat> and uh, then I think we're gonna try to head to Montana for a bear hunt. So a lot of cool stuff coming up. Make sure you stick around. Click that subscribe button right there in the middle. Thank you guys for watching.